Dear Daddy Long Legs, I love college and I love you for sending me. This place is just so cool. My classes are just fantastic. I mean, I'm kind of a little lost, but then I did miss a year schooling. So I'm hoping that once I get in the swing of things, I'll be able to handle it. The professors are so much better than I thought. I kind of imagined like the stereotypical, like old fashioned suit wearing, gray beards, furrowed brows, things like that. Just looking very scary. <laughs> but thankfully, there's men and women teaching and uh, all of them are just really great. I mean, one might be kind of strict, but overall I just, <laughs> they're really nice and they're funny and they crack jokes and I mean, hardly any of them are gray. Not that there's anything wrong with being gray. <laughs> right? Anyway, it's also super cool because here um, I have the opportunity to really learn the material. Like, I remember back in high school, I had to just work my butt off trying to keep up because everything was um, crammed in. That way we knew the material at least a little bit in time for the state tests. So it's really great to be in a place where I feel like things are paced better, if that makes sense. <sighs> this is just such a great, this is, wow. I don't see how life gets much better than this. There are a few um, interesting things, though. Uh, I mentioned before, um, my roommate, Ellie the Senior, she is that way. And Julia and Sally, they are straight ahead. When we're in the family room, living room, whatever you want to call it, uh, Ellie gets kind of angry at us if we're too loud. Um, so, <laughs> I mean, I guess it is a stressful time for her. I don't even want to think about being a senior right now. I don't see her a whole lot, so it's not a big deal. Sally McBride, um, one of the freshmen, she's super nice. Like, I've never met anyone who's as nice as she is. I think, well, I mean, I hope we get to be good friends. The main source of issues at the moment here at the dorm is Julia Pendleton. Oh yes, where do I begin with Julia Pendleton? Obviously, she is God's gift to mankind. Uh, she's from New York, and she's very elite, darling. She's oh so rich. <laughs> I swear, she gives me the biggest glare whenever I wear sweatpants. Like, when I'm not going anywhere. And she gives me this dirty look, like... Really? <laughs> it's ridiculous, kind of. I mean, it's starting to get on my nerves, but I mean, I can still laugh about it. And, well, most of the girls in my classes are pretty decent. I guess I could just imagine them all to be snobs, which maybe makes me a snob. I should probably work on that. I mean, Julia is pretty much the only person who's fallen into that stereotype. Everyone else is just normal. Like, in fact, I think they might be even nicer, some of them, than people in high school. Well, my experience with the public school system and the students there are... Uh, that's quite a tale. <laughs> um, anyway. Oh, uh, I am trying out for the basketball club, which should be really, really fun, because I never had time to do sports or clubs or anything like that. I mean, I'm still going to work really hard, and I'm not saying I have a ton of free time right now. I don't want your money to go to waste one bit. But, you know, I don't have to look after all those kids anymore, so I, I guess it's kind of weird trying to figure out something I want to do, you know? Oh, another thing I wanted to say was just thank you so much for the phone. It's really, really cool. And there's apps, and I can play Angry Birds. I finally understand what that whole Angry Birds thing is, and it's so much fun. I have my first ever contact, and that is Sally McBride. And, um, yeah. Oh, another thing I think is pretty cool about all the freshmen stuff here, at least in, you know, my dorm, is I think me, Sally, and Julia got put together because we all started school a little bit late. Like, I mean, obviously I took a year off from school, 
uh, thinking I'd never come to college. I guess Sally actually repeated seventh grade, so she is a little bit older than some of the usual freshmen. And then Julia actually traveled for a whole year, so that's cool. Uh, she started decorating her room, including Sally's side, with pictures. It, it's really getting kind of excessive, and if I hear her talk about France one more time, I might just smack her. Yeah. But I just wanted to say thank you. Thank you so much again. Only no thank you, because you don't want me to thank you. Can we just please ignore that rule? Good night, Daddy. I love you lots for what you've done. Good night. Together is all we need.